There's this uh, tendency in people. It's one of the oddities that I see about the nature of being. It's this tendency to want to be on one side or another of what is a fundamental duality. That is, the nature of the mind is that the mind is always measuring and it's always measuring this and that. And in terms of the way in which the not-self operates, the not-self is always assuming that the this or the that is better than the this or the that. There's always this you know, selection game that is going on in terms of the mind. I want to talk about type. And I want to talk about type within a duality, what it is to be a duality, and what it is to understand that the thing that makes you a certain type is something that's deep within your biology. Every type has a theme. These themes are now common. That is the frustration of a generator, the bitterness of a projector, the anger of a manifester, the disappointment of a reflector. These are called not self themes. And there is an assumption in this naming that these themes themselves are to be eliminated entirely. Well, it's not true. On the other side of these themes is what's called signature. That is the possibility that is there inherent in type. That is to be satisfied as a generator, to be a success as a projector, to find peace as a manifester, to meet surprise as a reflector. This is the other side of that coin. But it's not a matter of, well, it's one or the other. It's not a matter that if you're going to be a correct, a generator, that you're always, always going to be satisfied. It's not the way in which it works. It's like a seesaw. Really, it's like a seesaw. And it's not about finding the balance in the center. Truly, it is not. It is about all the possibilities of the various levels that can be there in that seesaw. More satisfaction than frustration, more success than bitterness, more peace than anger, more surprise than disappointment. It's as that seesaw begins to tilt towards the positive, towards the signature that you have a signpost that says your life is in transformation. It's what it's all about. Follow your strategy and authority. And in following your strategy and authority, be a witness to this changing of the seesaw. Be a witness to this transformation of what has been the dominant theme in your process, suddenly finding its signature. It's a beautiful thing to experience. Got a dream in a tear last night, watched the world fade out of sight. Seen the ghosts of time preside, eagle sword and falcon's cry. Sleeping phoenix on a rise.